Hello everyone, have a nice day. Take courage, it is I. Don't be afraid. Jesus says it in Matthew chapter 14 verse 27. When the disciples saw Jesus walking on the sea, they were terrified. It is a ghost, they said, and they cried out in fear. At once Jesus spoke to them, Take courage, it is I. Don't be afraid. Why do we afraid? We are afraid of evil, accident, sickness, natural calamities, strange persons, violence and terror, etc. In these moments, what comes to your mind? Do you feel that you are alone? Are you scared that you are helpless? Are you frightened that you would die? Do you feel that you are in a miserable situation? Have you started to curse your life saying, my life has become hopeless? Never, never and never feel that you are alone and prone to be perished. Jesus is an answer for you to take courage in these moments of disappointing and losing hope. Be strong enough to say, God is with me. Be bold, bold, bold to, say, to say, God will God save, me. save me. Stand up to say, God will protect me. And be still to say, God is my savior, who protected, saved and delivered the people from all evil powers, from generation to generation, who trusted in him. No matter how powerful the natural calamities are, no matter what conspiracy the enemies plan out, no matter when life seems to be unpredictable, but God still there to give you courage to rise up again from fall. And these are more evident in his words which he gave courage and life to the people who got afraid. We witness them also in the following biblical references. First Chronicles chapter 28 verse 20 David said to Solomon his son, Be strong and courageous and do the work. Don't be afraid or discouraged, for the Lord God my God is with you. And then Psalm number 27 verse 1 says, The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? And we see in 1 Corinthians chapter 16 verse 13, St. Paul says to the Corinthians, Stand firm in faith. Be courageous. Be strong. Yes, my dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, when we are strong enough in our faith, nothing can stop us or destroy us. But when we start to doubt the power of God in times of trials and crises, we may perish. Amen.